Yo, what's good? This is Urban Eat Me Pope, and welcome to another edition of Plaques. This week, we're going to get right into it. My man right here, Jay-Z. Can you believe Jay-Z? Little boy from Watson, producer for Jay-Z. Hey, look. The joint on this album is Dream, featuring Biggie Smalls and Faith Evans. Let's get right into it. Actually, the story happened like this. No lie. My man, Angelo Sanders, shout out to Angelo. Changed my life, brother. But look, Angelo was an a and at Dr. Dre's label, Aftermath at the time. So I was doing a lot of keyboard work for Aftermath and a bunch of different labels. So when a producer comes in town that needs musician, he would call me. So this particular evening, um, Angelo called me. I think I was on my way to a date. So man, I did not want to do the job. I just wanted to go on a date. I think I actually lost a chick that night, too. Angelo, your fault. But look, check this out. This is how it went. Angelo called me. He's like, man, do I want to answer this call or do I not want to answer the call? So I ended up answering the call. He's like, look, bro, I got a producer in town from Chicago that needs some keys. Can you please go do the session for me? I'm like, all right, I'll do the session. So Larrabee West uh, was the studio. I walk in, it's a producer, um, like I said, from Chicago. Um, but he had me sitting in the session for like 30 minutes. He just on the phone talking. I'm like, bro, I really don't want to be here anyway. So I just go up to the lounge and uh, start shooting pool. So about 10, 15 minutes later, he come up to me like, hey, bro, um, yeah, I'm, I need you. So I go downstairs, he put the song on. Um, Can you play a bass line in this? I listen for a couple minutes and like, did my thing, did a bass line. He gets right back, he gets right back on the phone. So guess what I do? I went right back upstairs. Continue playing pool. He came back up one more time. Hey dog, hey, um, I really need you downstairs. I don't know why he left. I'm like the bro, you on the phone. So long story short, I go back down and add a couple different layers. Can you play piano on this? Can you play strings on this? Uh, can you play, I think one other thing on this, and guess what the song turned out to be? Dreams. I end up uh, producing another song, or co-producing another song uh, called Never Let's Me Down. So what was that producer name that did that? Oh yeah, the little producer from Chicago was Kanye West. So that was the introduction to Kanye West. Um, a lot more plaques came from that very same session. Um, from that session, um, he continued to call me back and back and back and back. So I worked consecutively with Kanye for three years and also bringing other musicians on board to create a sound. So that's my story for this week. Plax, it was all a dream. You know what I'm saying? So check me next week. We're going to do another story, though. It's going to get intense. I'm telling y'all, these stories are insane. Plax.